What's going on? Hope you're doing well. This is going to be a quick tutorial on how to uh, export to a QuickTime in Logic Pro. So let's say that you have done, you've scored a movie or you've written a bunch of music or you've done some sort of audio project to a movie. I'm not going to show you how to, how to import the movie and all that. This is just how, once you've figured out how to get the movie in here, and you're ready to export your mix to show the clients. How do you do that? Well, it's pretty simple. First of all, you're going to want to, most likely, you're going to want to select the range just to be safe of what you're exporting. So we'd select the whole movie here. And then you're going to want to go to File, Movie, Export Audio to Movie. And what that's going to do is it's going to export it. So let's just go ahead and do this. Um, you want to select, you know, your your format. Usually, uh, it depends on what you want. PCM is going to be the best. AAC is going to be a compression, and Apple loss lossless is going to be a better compression. Um, usually, your sample rate is forty eight, but you're going to need to know these specs. Um, and then your bit depth. So let's, uh, I, I like to go with 24. So here we go. We're going to save. And it's going to bring up this dialog. And what this is, is this, this audio was already with, um, this audio was already part of the movie. And usually when you get, uh, um, a movie, you're going to want to re-export and replace it with your own mix. So we're not going to have this checked. But if you want to leave this or the original audio in the movie and just add what you added to that, then then you're going to want this checked. Okay. But I'm going to uncheck it, and we're just going to add our track. Then you're going to hit OK, and then it's going to bounce everything out, and then the new movie will have. The new QuickTime will have my my mix or my song to it, um, and that is how you do it, folks. Usually, even if you're working with dialogue or, or something like that, you'll want to download that audio from the movie or import stems and adjust the mix so it sounds better um, to whatever you've added. So uh, that is it. It's really that simple. Um, let me know if you have any questions below, and I can hopefully help you out. And uh, feel free to like and subscribe. And as always, I hope you have a great one wherever you are. And look, it just finished. Awesome. All right, take care.